All right, Dave, I um, thought I'd start up here quickly. Um, you've got a nice little winter view that way. Uh, they are building some, you know, some big newer homes over here. Um, yeah, as you can see. All right, so this is the alleyway behind the house. This is that little garage. As you can see, parking is probably, as is often the case, the biggest challenge in North Shore. Um, you have a little bit of space over here. You could probably fit another car over there. Um, but this garage, one car garage, is your main parking. Um, <clears throat> I don't see any signs telling you that you cannot park along the streets, but... Um, yeah, for guest parking, that would probably be the street parking either along this or at the bottom on Dugdale. So, um, just walking along here real quick. Um, this is the, the house. You kind of come up to the back door. That would probably be the door you would use most frequently. But let's go ahead and walk in to the front door. Um, this is vinyl siding here. It definitely sits really high up off the street. Uh, the slope here on the front yard is not as bad as I thought it might be. Um, but yeah, that's your that's your front yard. Go up to the entrance here. Um, of course, you know, hodgepodge of different style homes, all pretty well taken care of. It looks like a newer home next door to it. Let's just go ahead and pop in. It's a pretty quick tour inside. Um, this is the living room. Um, you know, decent size. Well, uh, you know, ni nicely done. I, I do like this big picture window here. This is really nice. Uh, kind of see all the way up and down the street. There, all right. We'll walk quickly into the um, kitchen. Um, small kitchen, pretty typical of North Shore. Um, there's that back door we just came from. And then all the typical things. And your washer and dryer here in the kitchen as well. Alright, so basically a little hallway, uh, first bedroom, they're using it more as a den slash art studio kind of thing, um, you know, probably about a 10 foot by 10 foot room. Um, this room is kind of the, the master, so to speak, it doesn't have, you know, any kind of ensuite or anything, but it does have the, the biggest closet <clears throat> um, which is just kind of a normal depth all right uh, again this one you know this is probably 10 by 12 um, feet in size and then you have the third bedroom here another you know 10 by 10 kind of bedroom. Um, the closets are pretty traditional size, you know, pretty much very small. In the bedrooms. And then I come, of course, to the bathroom. Um, little, little retro, <laughs> some green and pink tile, uh, but they've kind of worked with it. Um, you know, some updates here and there. Uh, the lovely Pink tile in the shower. Very, very typical. Um, the little storage here. All right, I'm gonna hit pause and go to the backyard real quick. All right, we're back. Back door that goes to the kitchen. Little gate here. 
leads to the backyard. Um, so you have kind of your little patio section here. Um, some more backyard area back here. Just a little green space, fire pit, whatnot. Um, this is the back of the house here. All right. <clears throat> Then we'll walk into the garage again. This is your main parking and storage. Um, so the very first room here is kind of just a storage room. Got all the camping gear and bicycles and such. Um, and then the one car garage that leads right back out to the alleyway there. So they do have it air conditioned, so it <laughs> looks like they may be use this uh, for hanging out or I don't know um, and they do have another fridge back here as well um, and a little closet I don't know what's in here but oh well just a little additional storage so that's about it pretty quick tour um, and this is Dugdale Street